I'm going to share five and probably share six or so. Simulation of Gimel Siv Beis. So now we spoke about Shehiyah. And now we're going to speak about Chazara. So before we speak about Chazara, there's a... Um, there's, um, Sharet Siyan <coughs> in Sif <coughs> a very short Sharet Siyan which is very important if you look in the Mishra Bura here in Sif Chot and Lamed Zayin Mishra Bura? Mishra Bura Sif Chot and Lamed Zayin Mishra Bura Sif Chot and Lamed Zayin Mishra Bura Sif Chot Okay. Well, then. Well, then. You have it, the Mr. Bruce Zion. Yeah. Hmm? Yeah. 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 This is this is what's called this is the sheet of Kanani. But at the end of that piece it says that the only time you need uh Gorva Kotam according to Kananya is either when it's uh, it's it's and all at the end over at the end of that sheet of it says oi you're coming to return it to do Chazorah on Shabbos. Why? The Mexican Mavashal and Ma'ene Grufa. So, Mr. Spur brings down the reason the Issa Chazorah, they take something off the fire, you put it back on the fire on Shabbos. What's the reason for that? The Mexican Mavashal. It looks like you're cooking. And that's why Chazorah is always worse than Shahi. That is the reason they find in most of the Rishonim, Mexican Mavasha. If you look in the Sharet Siyan over here, Sif Kot Lam Zayin. Can I just be medotic here? Does that yeah. mean that if it's, if it's Garif V'Katum, then there's no such thing as Mechzik Mavasha, right? We'll see. If it's Garif of course it's Katum, would there ever be a problem? It depends, yeah. No, oh, that's not the issue of Mechzik Mavasha. I do have it. It happens. We have to have Tanai Chazara. We'll see. We'll get to it. But, he, but the Mishmur says the reason the Issa Chazara, why it can't take something off and put it back on, <coughs> even with the Stam and Vuralloy, is also the Mexican Mavashal. It looks like you're being Mavashal. If you look in the Sharet C in Lama Zion, it says Rashi Vaharan, those are the ones that hold us as Mexican Mavashal. We say for a Yashar, which is the Rabbeinu Tam, Issa, to the Kach Ina and Grufa, the reason why you need Grufa, Mishum, the Chshanoit Lamina Eish, it cools down a little bit. Just for Cheshinon, Shema Yichato Bechazara. Sorry. So here's a different reason for Chazara. Chazara is also closer to the Shema Yichato, but there's more of a Chashash Shema Yichato by Chazara than you have by Shia. Because when you take it off the fire, it may cool down a little bit. When you're returning it to the fire, even though it's Gara for cut, if it's not Gara for cut, I mean, it may be Mechato Bechol to make sure it stays hot. So those are the two reasons for Isra Chazara on Shabbos. It's so good to know both of them, and we'll see this big enough communis between the two reasons. So let's start see base. Kira she group for Ketumah, Kira that's Gara for Katum. So the first claw for Chazara, everyone agrees, is that it has to be Gara for Katum. But not the Lakadeo may allow, and you take the path from the, fa- from the stove, from the fire, the Atana, or the Kira, a full of a Shabbos, even on Shabbos, mutalak zero. So even if you take it on Shabbos, it's still mutalak zero. Chos man shehiro sachas, as long as the pot, the food that that they took off, is still hot. That's one tonight. This tonight, everyone agrees to. So you have to have gara for kotum, and you have to have reisachas. Everyone agrees to that. Now, <coughs> we're going to stop here a second. We'll get to the other Tanoi Chazar, or Eid Biyadai, we'll get to that soon. But first, these two Tanoim. So the Mugger of Rome here, Chief Cotton Yotet, speaks out, Reisachas, why does it have to be that the pot is still hot before you put it back onto the fire? And if it's cold, what's wrong? So says the Mugger of Rome, Chief Cotton Yotet, Reisachas, Shayatzala, this boy, has to be hot, that's called Yatzala. Reisachas doesn't mean that it's bubbling. Reisachas means Yatzala, this boy. I am Asher Kosov Simishin Yitches Siv Dalit. To loika ash. I like to oil Shabbos. What's that? To loika? To ash. Oil the Shabbos. Oil the Shabbos. Yeah, yeah. Oil the Shabbos. We said Arab Shabbos. That was the safer that he wrote. The Magen Avram wrote everything against? Yeah, yeah. 
Mother of Rome comes out a lot against Eilat Shabbos. Who is the Eilat Shabbos? No, that's not the Lavush. No, no, no. Yeah, no, no. Who's the Eilat Shabbos? name. I forgot his name. Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? It comes up a lot this acronym. Yeah, yes. the one who is a rat, a lot, a lot. And usually, usually the acronym is Va'ash Loy Ash. And what he means is Va'ash the other Shabbos Loy Ayin Shapir. He didn't check into it well. That's the famous Mori of Rav, Va'ash Loy Ash. And it means is the other Shabbos was an Ayin Shapir. He didn't check into it correctly when he wrote it. But this is the Ayin Shin is the other Shabbos. So the one of Rome that is talking about the Tresachas. Yatzel at this boy, but not the Hakol of when it's down the Gamri, much cost of Simashin and Ches, Sif Tesvov. So now, basically what the Mogan of Ram here is saying is that the whole reason why you need Reisachas, because otherwise it's a Bishop problem. Because everyone agrees that you can't do Chazara on Shabbos, you have to have Garva Katim, and the one thing for sure you need is you can't be being Bavashal. So if you have someone that's Bashal called Tarkar, it's also to put it back on Shabbos because you're doing Bishop. Bishul is the Mishnah Deiraisa. So by the, the difference in Bishul between a Dava Lach and a Dava Yavesh, we'll see in Shimon Yud Ches. A Dava Yavesh, something that's dry, for example, a potato kugel, then you make it, you, you bake it, and, and it's finished, it cools down, you reheat it, a Bishul Lach, a Bishul. You can never cook it a second time. A Dava, it's in San Lagami, when you heat it up again, it's not called Bishul. You're warming something up, but it's not called Bishul. Water, when it's done a lach, a soup that becomes the tannin, and you reheat it, there's a machloikis already, you'll see in Shemin Shin Yud Ches, it's a machloikis, and me ask bishul acha bishul badava lach. What if the kugel is done, but you like it very well done? That's the Slavic Fiafel. The Slavic Fiafel is not bishul. Once it's a special called Tzorachoy, it's not called bishul. Even though you want it, you want it, as I say, oiske kok, you want it cooked well, doesn't make a difference. That's called Mitzamah V'yofla. Mitzamah V'yofla is not a Bishel. So but Lach, by Dava Lach, Yes Bishel Lach Bishel, it's Machlaikis, we Paskin in Shemesh Shin Yitches, Yes Bishel Lach Bishel by Dava Lach. So anything that's a liquid that cools down, you reheat it, Bishel Lach Bishel. So the, in Shin Yitches, the Ramah, Sif Tezvav, the Ramah is Mekel, and he says, if something is Yatzel at this point, right, and it's hot, but it can be different degrees. It can be 100 degrees, it can be 120 degrees. When does it lose the status of Bishel that if you reheat it, it's called Bishel? So it was 120 degrees, it went down to 115 degrees, and you bring it back up to 120 degrees. Is that called Bishel? No. Anytime it's Yatsa Lettuce Boy, no matter how much it cools down, as long as it doesn't go on the Yatsa Lettuce Boy, it doesn't make a difference. To make it hotter, it's not called Bishel. Once it goes on the Yatsa Lettuce Boy, it loses its Bishel status. And it's called Yesh Bishul Acha Bishul. That's yes, where the Machlag is. We're talking about Dabar Lach here. Only Dabar Lach. But, the Ramah is Mekel, and the Ramah says, we ho- we're going to pass in Yesh Bishul Acha Bishul, but Dabar Lach, but I'm going to be Mekel, and say that as long as it wasn't in Stan and the Gamri, it doesn't lose its Bishul status. So even if it goes under Yatzaleta's boy, it's going to be a Bishul Acha Bishul. That's no, 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 because he's made, he holds that it doesn't lose his bishop, it's not called, it's not Bavushal anymore, until it's under, until it's on the gum. It's hard to mark Machmir on that. It's hard to mark, it's hard to hold that once it goes under the Yatzel, that is boy, yes, Bishal, Lacha, Bishal. That's the Surgi and Shinyat Ches, we'll get to more by So here the Mechaber says it has to be a Sachas. Why? Because once it goes under the Yatzel, that is boy, according to the Mechaber, it's called Bishal, Lacha, Bishal. That means he's only speaking about a double lach. Only double lach, yeah. It's actually, yes, I'm actually going to say, I'm actually going to say, if thou live like us, the Nohabu the Hokel, and learn the Stan of the Gamri. We, says the Mogan of Rome, Ashkenazim, a Mekel, but it's not a Stan of the Gamri, but it's called a Simashin of Ches, if there's Vov. Over there it says that as long as it's not the Stan of the Gamri, ain't Bishop Acha Bishop. They don't lose its original Bishop status. Bayitzayim zeh ba'agov, b'chakosu b'shem b'ni yiruchem b'lekebach, avolim l'stanim, 
But if, lose, if it's not on the Gamri, us have a Bishel, then it's already a Bishel, the Ayin Simashin is Chesiv Dalid, the Yesh Bishel Acha Bishel. So this Tanai of Reisachas, that the Machabe says, for Chazor you have to have Reisachas, that according to this Morgan of Rome is a Bishel problem, and according to Ashkenazim, it doesn't have to be Reisachas, it has to still be warm as long as it's not a Shan Lagamri. That's what come up with this Morgan of Rome. We'll see later on and see if, hey, then not everybody agrees to this. And it's not so possible. The Kubi Resachas is also Tanai Chazorah. Meaning, as long as it's not hot, nothing to do with Bishel. If it's not hot, it's not Resachas, yes, at this point, then there's a problem with Tanai Chazorah. In order to return it, one of the Tanai, the Tanai, the, the, the you have to have to be one of the conditions. Conditions, yes. One of the, one of the conditions you have to have in order to, be, to put it back in the fire is that it has to be Reisachas. So Mokhav Ram here is not learning that way. Sorry, Reisachas? Reisachas means hot. 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 Yes, Reisachas, the Mokhav yeah, Ram says, what does hot mean? Boiling. 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 It's usually boiling. Now. Right. So that's what the Mokhav Ram starts off. Reisachas, don't know Reisachas means boiling. The first word the Mokhav Ram says, Reisachas, Shayat yeah, Shaladas, boy. Oh, so he, interesting. Even though Reisachas usually means boiling, here it doesn't mean boiling. Here it means hot, yad to let this body. Your hands get burnt by it. We have to pull your hands back when you touch it. But it doesn't mean <coughs> boiling. Everyone agrees that even though it's not boiling, it's only yad to let this body. It's still hot. It's still ain't bishal acha bishal. And this is a bishal issue, according to the Morgan of Rami. So that's the Morgan of Rami. Sif Khan <coughs> That's when the Yusachas, the Skadari, remember this Morgan of Rome, we'll bring it up again and see if, hey, I will show that everybody agrees to this. No, no, but a quick question, a quick question. If, if it isn't an issue of visual, if it isn't like him and it's not an issue of visual, so what's the problem of putting it back then? If it's not Yusachas? No, no even, even if it's there, even if it is. If, if it's not hard, if it's not hard, it could be it's Mexican Mavashal. Mexican Mavashal? Yeah. It's not Bishal, yeah. Right. It could be it's Tanai Chazara because it looks like it looks like you're okay. you, since he puts on the coal back onto the onto the flame, okay. it looks like Bishal. Are we Choshesh for both those opinions? What do you yes, mean? Yes, they can We'll see. We'll see. Pasha as we are. Yeah, it seems that way. Okay. We'll see because we'll see when we get further on the seat. <coughs> Fine. That's that's one Tanai, one Din of Chazara is Vesachas. So it has to be Yat to let this boy, and according to the Morgan of Ram, it has to be that's not a sound of the Gamri. Like, it goes without saying, I think, if, if, let's say it wasn't Rasafas when you took it off. Like, it has to be Rasafas when, when you, you put, put it, it back. back. Yeah. Well, let's say it was it was cooled down, sort of, be, it was just a low flame or something. Before you put it back? When you took it off to begin with. Yeah, so then, then if it's, if it's back, sure you can't saying, put it back. No, it doesn't make a difference. If it's but Bishel, if the problem is Bishel, that doesn't make a difference. If you take something off the fire <coughs> and it wasn't hot, you can't put it back on. You're being a vassal. Right. You're cooking it. Yeah. Doesn't make a difference what, what condition it was when you took it off. Mm-hmm. As long as when you're putting it, if, if it's a problem of vessel of cooking, mm-hmm. you see, Mexican vassal could also be the same thing. Now it says to the Moagov, "Oy to be yada, it's still in your hands." And the Mechaber says, "Lo nicha gabakarka." Now, what do these words mean? I saw in some of the numerous Taburis, you have "Oy to be yada." The, the remark is always in italics. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I saw some of the Rusha Khanara of Mr. Bruce, they have the Vaid Biyada in regular print. Mm-hmm. That's a terrible mistake. You have for you? No. Yeah. 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 Terrible mistake. And with the Wikipedia. <laughs> 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 yeah. No. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's, 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 that's the word I've got. It says Vaid Biyada. Vaid Biyada, but it's. It's, uh, it's big letters. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, ter- it's a terrible yeah, mistake. That's a Ramah. Yeah, then that's a Ramah, yeah. That's the Ramah. This is a Ramah printing. Hi, Pope. No, 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 this is a remote yeah, yeah, yeah. it, It's not as bold as yeah. a macabre. But all of them are like that. Yeah, well, there are more, but some of the Mishra yeah. Bruce have it, the other be other in, in, in regular letters. No, no, no. I, let me see. You have the same Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, uh, it says uh, Hagar. Well, yeah, though, it's only the Ramah. It's not yeah, the Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. Only the Ramah. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's a light. Right. Yeah, it's a light. Some of the new ones may be. Because if you put on a mitah, put it on a mitah. Yeah, yeah, we get that. Yeah, yeah. It's very the is the Ramah. It's not the Machaber. We can't confuse that. Right. Right. Yeah. There's a change there. Yeah, it's, it's a terrible printing mistake. Jay, did you say Haggadah? It says Haggadah. It says Haggadah. Yeah. 
So, so the Rosh has always to be all day, but the Rosh has always to be all day. So what does this mean? Basically, when you take it off the fire, you have all, everything else you have. It's, it's, um, it's Skor of a Kotor, and it's hot, it's Vesachas, you're okay. But you have to have Sinai Chazor, conditions of putting it back. But Pasha's the reason we have to have these conditions is, so the Shura look like being Mavasho. So let's start off with the Mechavah. The Mechavah will take it off the fire, and you put it on Gabi Karka. You put it on the floor. Says the Mechavah, that's not good. You can't put it back anymore. Why? Because the Sina Lechatchila B'Shabbos, to put something on, Lechatchila B'Shabbos you can't do. Chazara, returning it, you're allowed to do. Take, some, to take something that was not on the fire, and to put it on the fire, even though it's a special Kotzar Chayim, it's Gara for Kotzar, doesn't make a difference. You cannot do that on Shabbos. You cannot put something in the oven on Shabbos from the refrigerator, let's say, or even if it's hot. If it's before Shabbos, it was hot. And you want to put it on, you have to have Tanai Chazar. You cannot put it on the floor. That's the Lord Nicha Gabi Kaka. The Ramad says, What's the difference? Why do you mean it's still in your hand? The difference between the Mechaber and the Ramad is if you put it on a chair, you put it on a table, that's called not Oydibi Yadar. It's not in your hands. The, mecha- the, the Ramad has a bigger Khumra than the Mechaber. The Mechaber says you put it on Gabi Kaka. The difference between Karka and the Safsal is a Karka means I'm finished with it. It's not a place that you put it down and sometimes you put it back on the fire. The place would say today, that's called the refrigerator. Once you put it in the refrigerator, it's already showing that you're not putting it back on the stove. <coughs> some person will say it, some person will argue, but the question, the Mechaber definitely holds, you have to put it in a place that shows that you're not going to put it back again. And the Ramad says that, no, you have to have more than that. You have to t- keep it in your hands. If you put it down, even in a place that you usually, sometimes, you put it back onto the fire, so it's so not enough. It's so like so a so counter. A counter, a table, so a table, a table may be a gabakaka. A counter for sure is not a gabakaka because all the time you put something on the counter, you put it back on the fire. Right. Right. So they have those, they have those, those things you put under the pots. Right. Uh, for what they're called. The, 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 Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and it does. So it should have burned the countertop. Yeah. That's a short called the salsa. It's not called a gabakaka. That's a short called a salsa. Those things are called alasafsa, it's not called agabi kaka. Agabi kaka has to be that you're showing, you're not putting it back on the fire. So maybe you bring it to the table or you put it down there, you're showing you finished with the fire. And according to the Mechaber, if you put it on, on the ground, but you don't let it go, for whatever reason. No, it's still uh, agabi kaka, agabi kaka, no, once you don't leave go from it, that is a gilidas. That, that itself is a gilidas. Okay. You're holding on to it the whole time, that itself is a gilidas. So, so again, the Ramah holds Agav Oide Biyadai, and the Mechaber says, So the, the Ramah over here has one Khumra over the Mechaber that you have to still hold it in your hands, you can't even put it down on the countertop. So the Nicha Gabi Karka is the Mechaber. Now, I, I told you, the refrigerator, there's different places that say different things exactly, what's called the Gabi Karka. I'm not going to get into that right now because there's a lot of different shittas. The main thing you have to know is the chilv between agabi karka and agabi oide biyodai is what is you show me you're not going to put it back on the fire and one is a place they put it down even though you can put it back on the fire. So if you look in the um, in the Morgan of Rumsif Khan Chov oide biyodai the rabbi says to Svirlai Tafka kishen nicha agabi karka osin only you put it on the ground osin ava nicha magabi mita it's afso you put it on a bed or a bench oi Shepina and Mimechem Lemechem. So the the Mogamab mm-hmm. throws in over here, Pina Mimechem Lemechem. Which you didn't put it down, you pour it from one pot to the next pot. And we will get into that a different time, exactly what the issue is of Pina Mimechem Lemechem. We'll get into maybe in Sif. Gimel Dalad. Avul Mos Vile, the Chol Elu Osir. All of these are Osir, the Havalek and Moshev, the Shabbos, the Chatchila. So as if you're putting it in the Chatchila on Shabbos. So the Ramah has a khumra that if you, if you, even if you put on a safso or a kisei, a temporary thing, it's a, safso is a, is a bench. bench. Even though you put on a temporary thing, the lacha is, it's as if you, it, you can't put it back on the fire on Shabbos. Mm-hmm. That's what the Ramah holds. Find one khumra. Next thing is, the Ramah The Ramah holds, you also have, you have to have a mind <coughs> to put it back. You take it off the fire, and you don't have a mind to put it back, 
Even though you didn't put it down yet, you finished. So it's, it's dependent on your dots. You have a mind to take it over. You're not going to put it back. You can't put it back anymore. So before you take it out, you have to think that, oh, I'm going to give it, put it correct. back on and fire. Correct. And if you have it in mind, then you don't have to necessarily hold it, right? No. Okay. You do. Sorry, you do have to. Do? We'll see in a second. Uh, yes. According to the more you do, we'll see. Both. Maybe we'll be make it in a second. But according to the more, you have to have both. Okay. You have to have it in mind when you take it off, you're going to put it back, and you can't put it down on anything. Says the the Mogha Brahma Daitul Haksa, if our Rabbi says it's free lay, the Philo ain't Daitul Haksa, sorry, for Shkos of Ramba. The Mishes of Hold, which is the Machaber, so Hold, you don't even need Daitul Haksa. Even if it's not Daitul Haksa, it's Mutter. So here you have a Khumra of the two Khumras of the Ramah. You have to have Oid of Yoda and you have Daitul Haksa. So that's the Ramah and the Machaber. The Mishes of Mishabur is Makal. It says like this the Mishabur says that. And this is, this is what most folks will go with today. That if you take it, if you take it off the fire, and it's died to the hagzir, even if you put it on gabi kisei v'safso, a temporary thing, you're not put it back on. Mm-hmm. <coughs> right? Even if you're not holding it. Even if you're not holding it. Right. A gabi karka, not. If you put it on gabi karka, and even though it's died to the hagzir, so the Alocha says it's very hard to make on that case. Only a gabbis mita b'safso. Then you're okay to put it back. Daito l'hagzim. The same thing if it's ain't daito l'hagzim and you didn't put it down yet, then it's also make home. That means if you have one of the two tenoyim, one of the two tenoyim chazara, you hold it's okay. But, you, but if you're missing both of them, one of the two chumras. For the Khumris, you're okay. A bit quicker to the Mishnah Bura. But in the Mishnah Bura, in Nunvav, he says that you, even if you uh, did not think about giving it back, putting it back, and you're still holding it, you cannot, uh, you cannot bring it back on, on, on the fire. Only according to the Ruma. He himself was making at the end. The Mishnah Bura himself was making at the end. Look at the Mishnah Bura. Nunvav. Mishnah Bura. Look at Nunvav. Yeah. Yeah, it's fun. But I am a bear locker. At the Nunvav it says, but I am a bear locker, the last two lines of Nunvav. Shaveno Harbe Marishan Shemakilin, but Oid the Miyadoi. I feel the way Daitel Hagzir. But Hey Makilin, but Daitel Hagzir. After my time is Sidim Yadoi. And if you look at Nun in the Sharon Sin, I think it is, he says, Hainu Al Gabi Safsal of Adaimo. The only maker we put on a safsal on a bench or something, a temporary thing. Yeah. But if you put out Gabi Karka, Kimitra Daitel Haksa, Kofsu, Lifsek, Negev, Stimmel, and Shokan Arak, it's hard for him to be made for. There's something in the Bible that says that the Pisa of Shah Shish Lakel, the Mitzvah, the Rabbanam, the Badatol, the Hazir, the Shinicha, the Gabi Karka, he puts it on the ground. Correct, if you go a little weiter, it says that the way. You need to go on the Chod of Parad Legamo. If you go to the bank in the Be'alacha, he, he comes in another way. But Kol Ponim, he says, right, he says at least we could be Mekel, but it's Oid and Miyoda, he's holding on to it. And it's a Nichal Gabi Safso. He's not Mekel with a Gabi Karka. Look to the Be'alacha, the whole thing, you see. A Nichal Gabi Karka, and and and, and, and the Daita El Ha'achzir, he's not going to be Mekel so easily. He brings a Chazer Inish. It says that there's room to be lenient, even if you gaim she nichu al gabei safsal ve ain dai to lach zire. Yishim tziruf das haran. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we'll get to that. Get to that in a second. We'll get to that in a second. So that, so that's what Mr. Bruce says. If you have one of the the the, the, the remote brings down two chumras, you have to have oide biyadai and dai to lach zire. If you have one of the two. <coughs> Then the remote Mr. Brewer's make And t- in today's terms, putting it on the ground, the equivalent would be putting it in the fridge? Yeah. No, nobody yeah. gets it. So, 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 so most places. Some places can hold, right. even not the fridge. Right. Some places can hold, they put it on the table, let's say, the place they're showing. The main thing is, the main hakdor you have to know is, the main klal is, that karka means a place that you don't put it back from there onto the stove. Right. What exactly that means today, so a lot of people say it's a refrigerator, but a lot of other people would say even before the refrigerator. Yeah, it's like it's, uh, you put it in another room or whatever. Yeah, you show it that you finished with it. This, you're not going to put it back. Put it yeah, back. they're not going to put it back. So I don't want to pass in exactly what's called a gabbikaka or not, there's different sheets in it. Right. But the main thing you have to know is that a gabbikaka means a place that you don't put it back from there onto the stove.
On the countertop, usually you, you put it back onto the stove. That's a very interesting question over here. If I took off your pot, it's all your knowledge. Yeah, and I don't want to put it back. So I ruined it for you. You didn't die to the hoxer, right? So I was in your house, I took off your pot from the stove, and I didn't have a mind to put it back. Can I put it back? Yeah, is it, is it, is it the, the das of the person who took it off? Or is it the das of the balabais? Balabai, yes, yeah, so until I was said that the whole thing was going to balabais. <laughs> So there's a bit of luck here that says But it's a Shabbat, that's a word, right? Rizim Kibega, but Rizim Kibega calls it a filu and the Zeham and Niacha ya Adam Acha If you look at the bit of luck here the Mashal of Eloi Nicham Agabi Karka It's on page Chav Beis The Mishal of Eloi Nicham Agabi Karka The middle of the dot, he says the dot The Menicha Agabi Karka, Asho ha Yedaita Lakzira Asho ha Filu Dato Machabir The Chidushim Kibega, so I call it a filu and Zeham and Niacha Mm. It does help. Even though it's not his pot. It's not the same case, somebody comes to your dark room and put lights on without your knowledge. No, 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 I can't, I want to make you think of that by the Zara, I can't do that. Ain't Adam Oysa Davish Ain't Shalai. Here it's not that way. Because here, it depends on the Matthias. Take something off and you're putting it back. If I take your pot off the fire and I put it down in the Karaka, everyone agrees I ruined it. It's off the fire. So the same thing with Dai Tila It's dependent on the person's das who took it off, not on the Balbayas' das. That's what Kubek is. Okay, let's go, let's, let's go by it here. Says the Machabe, Vedafka al Gabba, Avalatoicha Osser. This whole Dini Chazara is only to put it on top. That was, as I spoke out of those days, Akira had a place where you could put the pot inside, there's a place to hang the pot in from on top. Says the Machabe, it's only talking, the whole time Chazara is mutter. It's only a gabo, only on top of it. Avotaycha into the oven also, you're not allowed to. Now why not? If you look in the let's see the Morgan of Ram here. Chov base, a gabo. Mid the sasa mina be sesi, since be sesi be sesi be shma mina, the sweet alay. The filu tolo hakadeiro take avot akira. Sorry, even if you hang it in, it doesn't have to be dafka that it's lying on top of this of, of the oven. Even if the pot hangs inside, as long as you didn't put it in from the bottom, you're okay. The mikri teicha elok kishay sheves. The mata b'kakoyis akira. The mata only means when you're putting it in on the floor of the oven. But if it's hanging in from the top, it's okay. Chechas the bach. Ayin the ayin sif gimel. The kasha b'shot the gibayim. Who b'kira is shalanu. Our kira. They don't have any nusach and arach the abbreviations. No, no. Only in the new mishabura. I thought the new ones have all the... I know, we found that. We found that in the new Mishnah Burra. The new Shulchan Aruch doesn't have it. Where is it? Okay. Shulchan Aruch. Shulchan Aruch. Shulchan Aruch. Shulchan Aruch. The custom of Shulchan Aruch, who were and our ovens, say Pshutais. Our ovens are Pashtun. There's no Teichon and Agavon. Which means like our ovens today. In those days there was a top and there was, an in, uh, there was a putting on top and you put it inside. So then it says you only have to put it on top, not inside. How about our oven said don't have a top and an inside. It's flat. What's that lock If he's not saying pshuta, it's teicha v'agaba echad hein, that's one thing. Umutin. At kan, that's what I should have said. V'im yesh eish alakira, ayin simashin chesif tazvav, kama vishol. So that's the Shulchan Kibbutz says that that oven is a shutois teicha va'agaba echotein, and it's mutter. 
So he can put it back inside the... Oh, what's that? So his case was, the Sotheke Baron's case was, there were pshutas. Everything was on top. There was right. no inside. Right. There was no inside. So I saw the being on the sheets. I didn't see it inside. So the Moshe Feinstein holds that our ovens today, where it's not pshutas, it's the opposite. The Sotheke Baron's case was that there was no, it, it wasn't a whole, um, he didn't put it in the oven. There was a fire, it was open, the whole thing on top, like our stove tops, and you put it on top. That's mutter. Why? Because even though there's no two places, still it's mutter. Now, the Moshe Feinstein learns from here that our ovens are also. Why? Why is it learned that way? I'm assuming so, I didn't see it inside. Because the header of Chazara that says in, our, in, our, in, in, in this thief is, you have a top and you have a bottom. Inside. You put it inside, that's a real place to cook. On top you also cook there. So if I'm doing something different, I don't put it in the main place of cooking. I put it on top, that's mutter. Says the Shulta Gubayim, in the ovens that have shutois, only one place to cook, it's mutter. Why? Because it's like the top. Says the Moshe Feinstein, but our ovens that are all toichoi, it's also. They're all toichoi, it's also. That's what they've been down. She said, didn't see a merchant fire inside. It's not the intensity of the heat. No, because you're putting it in toichoi, toichoi looks more like bishel than on top. We have a problem anyway. We can't make ovens garb for cotton anyway. Yeah, and the chlamy. <coughs> right. Our ovens anyway is a palma chazar. It's not garb for cotton. But well, it's actually would be garb for cotton. According to Shilte Giborim, then, there's no issue, or he doesn't hold a mechzik bishel, right? He does. But on top, the psutois was a mechzik in Mavashal. He Even though that was the only way that Even though that was cook? the only way. It's not Mexican Mavashal. That was his cool of the Sotha Gubayan. But if you have an oven that's everything is inside, did the Sotha Gubayan, the day of Moshe said is also. Interesting that Arach HaShulchan says the following. <coughs> the Arach HaShulchan says that the head of the Sotha Gubayan was that any time there's only one place to cook, Chazar is mutter. So he would hold that our oven. He would hold that our oven is mutter. You could make a garbage. Yeah, if you could make a garbage cut, it would be mutter inside. Why? Because the Arach HaShulchan learned the Shulchan Gabayim that the only iser to put it in is when you have a choice to put it on top or in, and you're putting it into the better place of Bishol, then it's more Mexican Mavashol. But if you only have one place to put it, then there's no Mexican Mavashol. So look at Arach HaShulchan, you see that's what he says. Okay. But Tanner says the Mukhabavite also the Hakzir, a fill of Ugar of Vikatum. A Tanner, even if it's Gar Vikatum, you can't put it in. Why not? Because we know the cloud is a Tanner, Gar Vikatum does not work for it. So if you, even though you do Gar Vikatum to a Tanner, it's as if you didn't do Gar Vikatum. And where the Tanai Chazara is, you have to have Gar Vikatum. <coughs> so therefore, a Tanner also has to have a fill of Gar Vikatum, who was in the Kupach. And we'll see that the Gefes Ve'esim because it looks like a, 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 a kupach. Gefes Ve'esim is the same din as a tanner. So the clause you have to have a garb of kotam, a tanner or garb of kotam does not work for a tanner, therefore you can never do chazar in a tanner. Our ovens of hashlas are called the kira, and if you would be able to do garb of kotam in our ovens, then you'd have this machloit between the Ramayish of Einstein and the Kishofa. Haga, the dafka shatavsum of Bushra called tzarchan. This is a cloud you have to have. Anytime you do chazor, it has to be the class of chazor, because if it's not, you're over your ambition. <coughs> For us, mortal hachzida, full of the kira, acheras, you can even put it to a different kira. We'll get to that in a second what that means. Avo, im, loin is pasha called tzarchai, also a full of oyster kira. It's not a pasha called tzarchai, then you take it off, you put it in the bag. What you're doing is you're doing bishul on Shabbos, and then you can't do. Uh, there's a there's a nafkamina lalacha, no? Because if you take out food to give a child during, you know, when the husband's davening, right. can you put it back in the oven? So right. according to the Aruch Hashulchan, you could, but according to Rav Moshe, you couldn't. No, no. even according to Aruch Hashulchan, our ovens you can't do garbage cut. No, if the oven's off. Yeah, the oven's off. Right, the oven's off according to the Moshe, you can't put it back in, correct? But according to the Aruch HaShulchan, you could. Yeah. Correct, our oven, someone shut off the oven before Shabbos. So it's called Garif HaKatum. <coughs> now, husband's in shul, and you take, out the food, you take out to give a child, you want to put it back in, according to the Moshe, you can't put it back in. Because it's a tana which is Garif <coughs> and it's still hot, it's still very hot the oven, 
the door, he does No, no, the oven stays hot for an hour yeah. afterwards, yeah. Very hot. If you look in the in the Mogav Rav Sivchan from Gimel Kira Cheres, in that part a different Kira, fill a half of a meruba even though it's hotter than the first one. Now this is very this is very negative a very negative kashayla. Happens a lot of times you have a crack pot and you leave it on high. Well, that says no is about tomorrow, and you leave it on high before Shabbos you make it to low. And usually, if the wife asks the husband to put it to low, usually the husband mistake puts it to off. That's usually the cloud. <laughs> <laughs> and then it's coming from Shul. Or forget Yeah, or forget it's on high, right. And then it's going to burn. <laughs> so what do you do? You come home Friday night and you realize you know, that you made a mistake. So if it's still hot, the, the crock pot is still hot, so then, you, then it's called, it's on a place, it's on an oven, it's got a cotton. So you now take it off and put it on. Now it's on the game, you don't have a black anymore. You put it by your, by your friend, maybe, if you want. It used to be a black. You used to have a black Friday night, and the child was in a crock pot. So the crock pot was off by mistake, and it was still hot. You can take it off and put it onto the black, even though the black is much hotter. That does not consider the equivalent of a black? Yeah, platter. Yeah, okay. yeah, if you have a platter in your house, and you realize the crock pot, something went wrong, either it's on high or it's on off, and it's still hot, you want to take it off the crock pot and put it onto the platter on top. That's the salakha. Even though... It's off, and it's not as hot as the plata. I feel a havla maruba marishayna. Even though the new place we're putting it is hotter than the first place, it's still mutter. Avlam ha'isa v'tchila t'muna. It was tamun. Or b'shabes bala yeshiva lekiro. I'm a kiro t'muna aser. So it was tamun. And I put it on a shia. Or it was shia, and you wanted to atmana on Shabbos, then you can't do. And that was the more in hilchas atmana v'shia, that... Hatmon and Shia are two different things. You can't bring it from Hatmon to Shia or from a Shahiya to Hatmon. But as long as they're both Shahiyas, they're going to take it over and put it onto the other one. But says the Mabai, the Yesh Ayyam, the Khalsa, any Asr, Rakish should not let me like Kira by Diyayim. Only when you take it from the Kira by day, but the Yazira Asher Khashaykha. This is the Shittis Iran. The Iran holds that the whole Dine Tnoi Khazar we're talking about. Not Chazara itself. There's two things. There's Chazara itself, which is you have to have Gaurav Akatum, and you have to have Resachas. That's for sure. So the Ran holds, we take it off on Shabbos. If it was on there on Shabbos, can we take it off on Shabbos? You don't need the Tnoi Chazara, the conditions of Chazara. Gaurav Akatum, you sure have to have. Resachas, you sure have to have, otherwise it's Bishop. So the Ran holds, we take it off on Shabbos, even if you put it on Karka. You had you didn't have dust to put it back. You let to put it back on Shabbos. But when does the Gemara say you need Tnai Chazara? By the Biyadai, the Nicha Gaber Karka, it's only when you take it off before Shabbos and you're putting it back on on Shabbos. Then already you have to have more. You have to have Tnai Chazara. Question so, on the end of Taz Yud. Yeah. The Chuvas Rama. Yeah, yeah. That. Yeah. That's not considered bishul. Is this according to Hananya? No, this is this, this is another problem. Was a chayshus that um, no, but macha ben drusai. It's bishul. and the guy is cooking for you. Yeah. And he says you're allowed to do it. It's matter. No, no, no. He didn't take it out of the oven. He says, you still have to do it Yeah. Yeah. And so he, he, he could reclose the oven, but he can't take the food out and put it back in. It's not about the soy. Oh, he didn't take it out. No, he didn't no, take it out of the food. It's the Torah. It's a, it's a, it's yeah. And open it. Open it and then reclosing it is an issue. The reclosing of the oven may be an issue. Because it, may, it makes the fire stronger. But um, the, the, the guy didn't take it out to put it back ah, on. Okay. Mm-hmm. Then it's Bishal Mamish. Right. He didn't take it okay. out. Okay, I misunderstood that. Yeah. So, uh, yes? Uh, on, 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 on that point, does the Machal was in the difference between the Rabbanan and Hananya carry through into the Chazar issue as well? No, 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 100% not. It doesn't at all. No, because what, what, it, total spatial called Sarkha is a Bishal. Right. 
the Hanani is only matter. No, Hanani is only matter. Shehiyo, Michael ben Tzoyi is not doesn't hold that Michael ben Tzoyi is called cooked. Uh-huh. He holds it in his bishop. He would say that after after Machab and Rishai, Chazor is also a problem. Yeah, Chazor is still a problem. Sure. But the uh-huh. in Shinya Testament we do say that. Go on. Yeah, the Shmuel brings down the Bira Lacha here. Yeah, that it, it is totally in the Machlokes in the Chananya. In other words, what you're saying now, this, you're learning this whole how this whole seed that could be when 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 Bishul occurs right. only only when it's. Uh, Rashi calls it Rashi calls it Rashi. It's even according to Chanan. Yeah, but in Shinya Tzitz, we're going to see that uh, it, 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 it even applies to Machal Ben Rusai. It goes back to uh, to what? What applies to Machal Ben Rusai? For Chazara. For Chazara. Sure. No, can't be. Chazara would be it. Would be also by Machal Ben Rusai. Everyone agrees Chazara is also Machal Ben Rusai. Is that good? Do I have Bishul? In the when he says here. Uh, Which Bira Lacha are you? Yeah, the doctor says that's the condition. It's in the Mishnah Bura too. Which? When Mishnah Bura? Samachal. Samachal. Yeah, why Mashal 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 Right, so you look in the Bira Lach, he says, Which Bira Lach are you talking about? Um, Bira Lach is on the word, yeah. Yeah, okay, but it's not Hananya. So what is it? It's not Hananya. It's not Hananya. There's some people, there's some in the hole, which could not pass in that way. The one that's marked about the story is not Bishlam. Right. We don't go with that. It's not Hananya. So should we show you? But that, isn't isn't that, that how we define I assume that that's learning no, 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 If you take the spara of the, of, of, of halacha aleph and you take it all the way through to, to halacha Yeah, yeah, I understand what you say, but I don't, I don't, I don't think it is that way. I don't think... I think that's what this, this was, that's what this dear Allah is, 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 is um, saying. That would you uh, work with the Gemara, right? Because the way the way we understand the Gemara for Hananya is that it applies for specifically it says it applies for Shia, not for Chazar. Uh, maybe that's the delineation. No. One is Shia, one is Chazar. But here the Mishnah is talking about Chazar. No, the the Mechaba says over there in Siv Dalad. Right? If you learn this passage called Sarachoy, I feel this passage called Michael Bender Soy, Shaykh Boy Bishol. The slow Shaykh Bishol. That's the Mechavah says, she is Chesed Dalit. The Mod doesn't argue there and say it's not Shaykh Bishol because he holds a Hananya. The Bialocha brings down that she did to show you that holds that Mons is Michael Bender Soy, it's not Shaykh Bishol anymore. It's not Hananya. It's not Hananya. How do we pass in the, the, that it's like Machel Ben Rosoy or do we... No, we pass in the... No, we pass in the... It has to be in the special called Sorfa. It's Machel Ben Rosoy, it's still it's a bishop. And at the end of the... Still it's a bishop. We'll come up on Kashi Lahakil, do we know what we mean in the Doraita? In the Doraita. In the Doraita. Yeah, we hold that Michael Ben that um <coughs> it's still considered Bishal after yeah. Michael Ben Yeah, yeah. So it's gonna come in out with you. There's not Hanania. This uh, if you record Hanania, phase is true. Yeah. So it means that that means you have to be very careful on Friday oh, what's Friday that? night. You have group of two months. Well, you okay, okay, I got both sides. It's a machabra. See follow. Sifal, Mechaber Sifal. Says the Mechaber, he brings down Chananya. He has to remember the culture of Basel and Michael Ben Rosoi. But he says Basel called Tzorcher. We have to mutter the Shoyes and Gabakira. It's mutter the Dushi here, right? Right. I feel the Hutzah because of the Eitz. I feel any group of Tuma. For the Hutzah, a group of Tuma, 
That's what we need but um, no, but definitely the Mishmur definitely speaks it out. I'll find it in the Mishmur. <coughs> Actually, Dafka to Raya to the opposite, no? To Raya the opposite. The Chenli Inyanim Natalak Dera Malo Balach Zira Leva Shabbat. Sounds like if it's Garb Vikatum, as long as it's Machab and Drusai, you can return it. No, no, I No? Hey, do you feel okay? I'm going to first one, see if I can find it. I can't find it now, I'll find it later. I can't find it right now. I can't find it right now, but it's definitely not Hanani. Hanani holds the Shaykh, perhaps it's Hanani holds the Shaykh Bishop, even Acham Acham Ben Nasoi, told the Spash of Gotharfim. And I just make by Shehiya when it's Machab and Nasoy, you're not going to come to be Machat anymore. Not because you hold Machab and Nasoy, it's called Bishop. And we would say that Bishop takes, uh, that it's already, it, that we, we wouldn't apply in Bishop or Bishop from Machab and Nasoy and, uh, and above. Yes, Bishop. Yeah, yeah. If it's Machab and Nasoy, we would say that we say it's Pam or Bishop. Yeah. It's a Pam or Bishop, even according to Hanan. It's not Bishop or Bishop. It's not even Bishop. It's not a special yet. It's not a special yet. Yeah, yeah. It's not Bishop or Bishop. It wasn't a special yet. So just to understand that this idea of Machab and Nasoy means what? Only for Shehia? The head correct. Only for Shehia. Only for Shehia. Only in Shehia. Correct. It's not a Ben Bishop. In Bishop. Correct. Only in Shehia. You won't find anywhere is a heter macha ben the sorry ben gay din a bishul. You won't find it anywhere. It's very lucky we down to the sheet of it. No, no, not even the other. I don't think so. I don't think so. So that means if you have a food that's not like on Friday night, when your food is yeah, yeah. So that the bishul I think speaks to actually yes. I'm not mistaken. If you have a suffix of something that is partial to macha ben the sorry or not, you can't put it back on Shabbos. What's about zero? Okay, so, yeah. That's so, hold on. In, in that situation, right. you wouldn't... Say to be a locker. It still wouldn't be able to put that on. Right. Because it's Michael Ben-Rusoy, you put it in. No, no, but it's Michael Ben-Rusoy, you put it in, you see, you put it into the... Uh, you left it with Shehia, but you didn't leave it with Michael Tumah. Yeah, so if, if that's it, it's Garfer Kotum. That's it, it's Garfer Kotum. So you said, if you did, if you did, you, you, you put it in, you didn't need to, but you did anyway. Yeah, you didn't need to put it in. So it would be a lot to fix that, it's but the fees are not of a Shabbos like Deirim and Akira. The Sophic law, in fact, is partial called Tzorchai. He's not sure whether it's partial called Tzorchai or not. Also, they lack zero. It's also to be, to be chayzer. Afshoi, the Biyadai, the Akira group of Tumo. It doesn't make a difference. Where's the Biyar Allah? Biyar Allah is a Shin Yud Ches. Siv Dalet, the Biyamas of Shaykh by Bishlam. For sure, past the Mahabandu. Yeah, yeah. Shaykh by Bishlam. Still, you can't put it back on, but it's still shy special. There's no killing if it's Hanani or if it's not, it makes no difference. Okay. So get back to the run. Yes, I mean the whole there ain't no 
But the Echzidu Ashachashacha, he didn't put it back to Allah, this is the Ran's Kula, the whole din of Tanoi Chazara, the conditions of Chazara are only if you take it off Erev Shabbos and you put it back on Shabbos. Now, Allah Hamisham Ashachashacha, he took it off Erev Shabbos, uh, uh, sorry, on Shabbos, I feel a Nichai Gabrikarka Mutter. Even if it's a Nichai Gabrikarka, it's Mutter because the, the whole Tanoi Chazara is only <coughs> when you take it off Erev Shabbos and you're putting it back on Erev Shabbos. Bechain says Rama the Hag and the Hakel. There is a minute to be makeal. But Tanurim Shalano shares them in Kira. And the same can Atna the Rama Kilim. People today, in those days of the Rama were makeal. So if someone took off a pot on Shabbos, and even though they put it down, and died to the Hakzir, it would be fine. Says Rama the Toy the Hakmer Hakmer. It's better to be Machmer. So it's interesting. But why, but why is there no Merseh uh, Merseh Kavishim? Because Mechti Kibbutz was only when it wasn't on the fire on Shabbos. But if it was on the fire on Shabbos, and you're putting it back, it's not Mechti Kibbutz. No, but the whole thing is that somebody would come and see you put it back on, it wouldn't know whether it's no, on or not. No, no, no. Lav Dafka. Lav Dafka. Because if too much somebody else coming in the middle, and you hold it in your hand, it doesn't know it was on the fire. No, I'm saying it. He's saying even the run, according to the run, even if you put it on, on the ground, you put it on the ground. Right. Why, isn't that yeah, yeah, yeah. Mechti Kibbutz was only is meant for the person himself. Love that for people don't know what happened. Because then you always have a maximum of action. Right, yeah. Practically speaking, how could the run hold but no. in, the, yeah. in this case? Because practically speaking, if you've got it on before Shabbos, what? It took before your, your, Shabbos. Your, your, your wife is going to go with the pot in her hands and then bench lift and then yeah, go to the back? Yeah, and the chlami. It's, it's a hard, it's a, according to the run, it's a hard case. What's the other biyadai? When, when Shabbos came in, someone had to hold the pot in his hand, so the last took it off the fire, he's holding it for a nice, a long time, and they put it back. And the Chalami, according to the Ran, it's an interesting me. case, how the fire <coughs> case. And the Chalami. But the Ramah says that the meaning of the Hakul, the time of the Hachmer, Miu, in the stand of the Kul, the Amma Asim. If it cooled down, everyone agrees it's Asim because we had before. You have to have a Sacha. So here's the Shittas around. The question is, could we rely on the Shittas around? Do we have a head with the Shittas around? The Shittas around would be a very big cooler. You take off your pot on Shabbos or Chalam Pazik, you put it back, no matter what happens. <coughs> as long as it's gone for Kotam and it's still a Sachas, you can put it back. So if you, you can put it down, and it ain't died to the Hachzer. So the rest of the place give don't rely on the Ram. The rest of today, the person don't on that side of the Ram. I don't think even the Mitzarvet for Kula, he does show me the the Chazanish. The Chazanish says that if you do put it down, they can be make it with the Ran. Okay, Chazanish says so. But uh, but if you ask the person here, most of them won't be serving for the Ran. They won't they won't be Mitzarvet for Kula. They won't use the Ran even to add to make it to a Kula. If you look in the in it's a Das Yachi. The Ran's a Das Yachi, yeah. If you look in the Morgan of Robert, the Ramah brings it down. That's the Chiddush. The Ramah brings it down. Right. It says, the Torah of the Hachmer. Right. It says, the Torah of the Hachmer. It's good to be Machmer. Right. That means if you have a Tzirut... Like the Katechila, you'd hold it around. Yeah. Right. The Katechila, hold it around. But he also says, V'chein no Hagin l'Hakel. Yeah, no. The, no, the Hagin was a minute of the Hachmer. <coughs> and the Ramah, the Klaal is that there was a minute of the Hachmer. It didn't go against the minute. Right. It's a Klaal in the, the Morgan of Rom. The Ramah, I mean. But it says, Sobot, Torah of the Hachmer. Look in the in the Morgan Rabbi Simkar of Dalg. It's nothing but Yerim Bimkain the Merkazire b'Shabbos. Have a lake and moisture with chila. It's like you're putting it now. Look at chila on Shabbos. Therefore, according to the Ran, you have to have to know a chazara. It says in the Morvai to Yerim the Ha'itli Ma'achem and Atanah b'Shabbos. You take that food from the Atanah on Shabbos. Also, la Nichai b'Karam b'Kesasayis. You now have to wrap it in towels. Because that's an issue here tomorrow. <coughs> if you look in the Morgan of Rumsen, Korn of Hay, the Gora Melahagzi, the Tana, is worse than returning it to the oven. To have a like a Tchilis Hatmana, that is like Hatmana, which is also on Shabbos. I always had a question in this room, all. I haven't found an answer yet. So the Muslims of Yesh Oimrim, if you take it out, you now wrap it up in Korn of Kassas. But he also brings, he says, I mean, a Tana, he's not saying about a Kira yet. Yeah, what's the difference? Take it off a tan or a kid, and now you want to wrap it up. Ah. The lucky is you now let a rat, you now do a tamana on Shabbos. Even if Davish ain't the most of heaven, even if it doesn't give off heat, 
You know, I'll take something and wrap it up in towels to keep it warm on Shabbos. Everyone agrees with that, Allah. And even, what you just said, even if it's not most of heaven. Even if it's not most of heaven. On Shabbos. Oh, on Shabbos. Yes. Yes. Well, 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 because you're not cooking well, yeah, we'll see when we get that tomorrow. We'll see when we get that tomorrow. The whole sugi, the sugi in itself. <coughs> you know what, that's not clear. Is an additional kula of the run? The run's kula is that it's the only time you need the, the conditions, the tenai chazara, is only if you take it off before Shabbos. Right. You still hold it in your hands, and you want to put it back on Shabbos. But on Shabbos itself, if you take it off the fire, then even though you put it down on the floor, or you didn't have a mind to put it back on, it's mutter. Oh, so he, as long as you have it in mind to return. So you don't have to have a mind even. You don't even have to have it in mind. You don't even have to have a mind, nothing. Oh. The only thing you need is Goro for Kato and, and Reisachas. Okay. That's all you need. All the rest of the Tanakhas are according to the Ryan you don't need. You don't have to have a mind, you can put it on the floor. You don't have to be home to okay, it. You don't have to be holding it. How does your Ryan learn this, Ramon? On Shabbos. Right. And on Shabbos is different. No, but, but, but the Ryan, where does, where, where do we see the Ryan holds? It has to be on the... You don't have to be other. Yeah, you don't. You don't. Need you don't need any, according no, to from Arab, from Arab, from Arab. No, but the man says the whole din of Tanai Chazara. Oh, okay, maybe it only holds for the Tanai Chazara of the Mechaber. Yeah, yeah, could be a Chrami. And a Chrami, yeah, yeah, a Chrami, yeah. yeah. So that is yeah, Whatever the Tanai Chazara is, right. you'll need according to the man. Mechaber, according to the Mechaber, the Ramah, according to the Ramah. Okay. 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 <coughs> but getting back to this thing, you take it out of the oven, you now wrap it in karmic sauces. The, the Ramah says a lot of Vyesh Oimrim. Some people say we take it out, you know, I'll wrap it. And that's what the VHM is. This everyone agrees to. Everyone agrees they can't be mat with something like a tchila on Shabbos, even with Dovish ain't the most of heaven. I don't know why there must have VHM. Maybe there's something unique about karmic sauce. No, no, it, it, it says over there karmic sauce. So I'm not, I'm not sure why it says VHM. If someone can find me, it says, I'll be very happy. According to the run, he would not require any of the other uh, Tanayi Chazara? On Shabbos. Uh, on Shabbos. Yeah. Correct. None of the others would? Nothing. Okay. Only Gaur Vakatim? We learned so yeah, yeah. After right. that? Nothing. So that's All the Tanayi Chazara. No huh? Mm-hmm. How, how no, the Chab Holder and Gaur Vakatim is a problem. Okay, we go. Okay, we go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's one. Yeah. Even the Chab Holder is one Tanayi Chazara. So the Chab the Ramor has extra Tanayi Chazara. Okay. Fine. Says the Ramavaito. We have some time this though? Mm-hmm. Um Christian should we go by it or should we stop here? No, keep going. Does it take us like about fifteen minutes? Yeah. yeah. Okay? Yeah. Fine. Yes, I mean some people say the house was summer the Khashekha. By some of the Barku, to Kabbalah Shabbos was done. So let me give back done before we see this in one time. The term that we had, Chazara was, you take it off before Shabbos, put it on Shabbos. You take it off on Shabbos, put it back on Shabbos. The Yesh Aymim now is a new Chumrah, which is Taisvis and the Rosh. And they hold that if you take something off before Shabbos for the fire, and you put it back on close to Shabbos, it's also awesome. You're also not allowed to do that. That's called Chazara Samoch the Shabbos, close to Shabbos. Now what does that mean? That means if you take something off the fire, you can't put something on the fire close to Shabbos. You can't do on the Sina Lechatchila right before Shabbos. That means even before Shabbos is a din Chazara. But food is hot, boiling. Food, we'll see in a second if food is hot or boiling. We'll get to that in a second. So there's something cool, we know till now, Chazara means you take it before Shabbos and put it back on Shabbos, or on Shabbos, put it back on Shabbos. <laughs> Says the Ramah, there's a Shabbos in the Rosh Hold, even before Shabbos it's called Dine Chazara. Now what does that mean? The Shabbos in the Rosh asks, hey, you put it on um, Friday afternoon, 12 o'clock in the afternoon, there's no Dine Chazara, it's Mutter. <coughs> so the Shir is, which the Ramah brings down, is, Kadei Shayitnu ala HBR Tiach. Because you have this food, if it's cold, and you put it on the fire, how long does it take to warm, make this food hot? 20 minutes to make it hot? That's that shear of Somoch the Shabbos. That's called close to Shabbos. And when you're in that time span, right before Shabbos, there's certain things you have to do. That means you can't, it has to be Gaur of a Katum, it has to be hot. You have to have Dine Chazara even before Shabbos. 
So you want to take something and put it on your fire. It's the special called Sarah fire. There's no problem with Shia. But you want to put it on the fire right before Shabbos, it's also. It's also unless it's God for the question. What, what's the problem here? Why, if I put something on right before Shabbos, what's the issue? So this is where we get into the, into the home of of what the problem with Chazor is. So the problem with Mexican Mavashal, there's no shaykhs before Shabbos, Mexican Mavashal. It looks like you're cooking before Shabbos. Who cares? Not Shabbos. Not Shabbos. So the Rosh says a Lashen, I'll see in a second, it's a big hill how you learn. The Rosh says a Lashen, the reason why it's also to put it on right before Shabbos is a Gzeira, they may put it on, on Shabbos also. A Gzeira. You put something that's cold onto the oven right before Shabbos, and it's cold, and it's getting hot on Shabbos, you may end up doing that on Shabbos also. A Gzeira up to Shabbos. So there's no real Issa Chazara here. The real Issa Chazara is Mexican Mavasho. And if Shabbos, there's no Mexican Mavasho. What's the Issa? It says the Rosh Ogzeira Otto Shabbos. You might. You might do it on Shabbos itself. We also learned that there was Shema Yifate. We'll get to that in a second. That's what the Rosh says. That's what the Rosh says. Toysvis. The second Svar of Shema Yifate also doesn't apply. One second. Toysvis learns different than, Rash, than the Rosh. And I don't remember who it is, it could be I made this up, I don't remember. But they say the Rosh and Taisvis are arguing in what the Isser of Shev, uh, Chazar is on Shabbos. Taisvis says that the Isser is Shem Yechat. The very time holds Shem What does Shem Yechat mean? You may stir in the coals. On Sh- Erev Shabbos, what are you worried about? Is it Shem Yechat Erev Shabbos? According to Ben Tam, yes, the Shem Yichat. What's the Shem Yichat? You put something on the fire before Shabbos and it's cold and you want it to get hot. If you put it right before Shabbos, so take 20 minutes for it to get hot. Now, you put it on 5 minutes before Shabbos, 15 minutes of it is on Shabbos, in those 15 minutes it may come to be Shem Yichat. In those 15 minutes, Shem Yichat. You want it to get hot. You put something on the oven because you want it to get hot. So Shemi Yechata. Therefore, you have to put it on so before it's Shabbos. In, in some ways, it's that it's already done. It's special called Sarchai. Viraloi. Viraloi. But you have something else over here. You want it to get hot. So we're talking about here that it, it's only if it's cold. If it's cold, yeah. If it's hot, it's fine. It's Shia. Huh? That's Shahia, really. What do you mean? Why isn't this called Shahia? It's hot, and you're just letting it in, go into Shabbos. No, either, no, no. Yeah, this whole thing is Shahir, really. Uh-huh. But we're saying this 20 minutes before Shabbos, it's worse than Shahir. Uh-huh. It goes into the Gdarim of, of Chazar. But only if it's cold. Only if it's cold. Only if it's cold, Pastor. In other words, you know, let's yeah. say you have something that's hot, and you're within 20 minutes of Shabbos, you're something. You want to put it on the thing, it's not Gdarim of Chazar, it's Kobit Mutter. It's Kobit Mutter. But then you're taking that problem away. Yeah, because it's hot already. It's not something cold. Pastor, it's cold. But, but. It could be, even if it's hot, then I'll have put on at that time, because next thing you put something cold on. Because now you have a zero of or two. No, you can't put, no, you can't put anything on, don't put anything on the oven 20 minutes before Shabbos. Period. So you can't put anything unless it's garbage cotton. Unless it's garbage cotton. So according to the Rosh, it's Mexican, Rosh, it's zero or two Shabbos, then it doesn't make a difference if it's cold or it's hot. It's zero or two Shabbos. According to the Ben Tam, that's Mexican, Mavashal Chazara. So what do you have over here? What's the Mexican? What, uh, sorry, according to the Ben Tam, that's Shem Yechata. That's very easy to understand. You put something on the fire right before Shabbos, and it has to get hot. It's a great Shem Yechata. Therefore, they said, don't put anything on the oven right before Shabbos. 20 minutes, whatever it takes to heat it up, you can't put it on unless it's got a cotton. This is very but so this is very good, yeah. But, uh, but, uh, but if it's cold, don't you miss it? Do you know it has to stay in this? I don't care. No, you want it to get hot. But make sure it gets hot. No, but things I'm putting in for Shabbat Dhaka because I know it's going to get hot wherever it's going to be. No, Shabbat Dhaka to, to make sure it stays hot. No, it's for, for the night meal. Oh, the night meal. So you're not. Yeah. So the point is you want to take something, put it in the oven, which is not garlic for cotton, right before Shabbat, and it's cold. It's an issue. 
what if you're not going to be home for the night meal, but you'll be home for the next day meal, and you're just putting it on? So Does it make a difference? If it's possible for it to get hot tonight, it's awesome. If it's possible for it to get hot now, which is always the case, then it's awesome. Well, except for a kid or a chaisa. Except kid or chaisa. We have to kid or chaisa in a second. Why is kid or chaisa mutter according to this? You put a raw, cold thing into the oven, it's mutter. Why is that mutter according to this? Because you're not going to do anything to it. It's not going to help in 20 minutes. Because Kedushai is only a hetter because it won't go till tomorrow morning anyway. Right. <coughs> yeah, if, if the oven's on, it's not going for cotton, and you forgot to put the kogel in, you want to put the challah in, let's say, and you put it in right before Shabbat, it's also according to this. According to this, we also to put anything cold into the oven 20 minutes before Shabbat. So whatever it takes, if it takes 45 minutes for it to get hot, it's in 45 minutes. Mm. Whatever it takes for it to get hot, you now have to put it into the oven with not garlic cut right before Shabbos. Does it have to be something that, for example, let's say you take a chola and you want to make it a little warmer. So you, the oven's been on, you turn it on, the oven on right before Shabbos. Turn, sorry, right. you turn the oven off right before Shabbos. So but it's you garlic put in the it's off, it's garlic cut. Okay. If it's off, it's garlic cut, then you're okay. But okay. the time when you put it in, it wasn't garlic cut. You're turning it off a minute before Shabbos. That's fine. As long as it's running before Shabbos, as long as it's before Shabbos, it's running it off. Yeah. I don't know, maybe not. <laughs> I don't know, I'm thinking about that. Why? There's no issue with Shabbos. Shahia, there's no problem, it depends on right when Shabbos comes in. So you can put something on the, on the oven, but it's not, not going to cut them up here, and then right before Shabbos, shut it off. Right. Chazor is not that way. Chazor is worse than Shia. Shia, the Issa of Shia is leaving it on the oven when it's not when it's Issa. Chazara, the actual Maisa is the Issa. The actual thing they're doing is the Issa. I'd have to think about that. If you put it on and you shut it right before Shabbos. That's the question. I mean, I'm not to be mad with it, but that's the thing of the reason why. <laughs> well, there's no issue of Shema right? No, but, but Shema Yachter is only by Shehia. The Issa is leaving it there, or leaving it there before Shabbos <coughs> with the Shema Yachter. Here, yeah, the Issa is before Shabbos. You know, putting put it on something before Shabbos has the Dean of Chazara. Chazara. Yeah. And the Issa is putting it on before Shabbos. Right. So you can shut up the fire a minute later, it doesn't make a difference. That itself is Davar Otsu. I don't have to think about it. So that's, that's the Issa over here. And there'll be a few nafki minutes if you hold Shem Yechate, or if you hold of, of yeah. uh, Mexican Mavashal. Mm-hmm. That means, well, one example is Tanai Chazara. This putting it on 10 minutes before Shabbos is called Chazor, not Shahir. You now have to put it on unless it's Gar for Katan. Now, do you need Tanai Chazor? Do you have to have Oide Biyadai? Let's say it was on the fire 20 minutes before Shabbos. I want to put the Blech on. It wasn't hot yet. So I put the Blech on. I take it off. I put the Blech on. Then I put it back on. Do I have to hold it in my hand? Oide Biyadai? Tai to the Hakzir? No, but that's Gar for. Yeah, but, but, but Chazor, you have to have Tanai Chazor. All right, but you have growth, I have growth, I have growth. Yeah, you have to have Tanai Chazara. This is the big one called Tanai Chazara. Tanai holds, you need Tanai Chazara, the Rosh holds, you don't need Tanai Chazara. Mm. Now, the, the Ramadan doesn't speak about, we've seen the Goyin in the second one, he says. So let's say it's a locker inside. And what happens if you take it from the fridge? You if you take, have, yeah, if you take, so it from, if you take it from the fridge. So then by definition, does that mean that you don't have the Tanai Chazara? Correct, correct. Which means <coughs> it doesn't even come on to the Shai. You, you, don't, right. you can't look at Chila. If it's Gara for Khatim, maybe it's Mutim. If you hold that you don't need Tanai Chazara, so you can take it from the fridge, and if it's Gara for Khatim, you can put it in. And if you require Tanai Chazara, then, then it won't be good. Then that's 20 minutes before Shabbos. But how you, it's shy, I mean, it's in the fridge. I mean, how, how do you have Oida Biyoda? What's that to the Hasser? Yes, the only case would be is. Is it happened to be on the oven? They took it off. Right, that's the case you said. But I'm saying, yeah. you know, yeah, you no, it in the morning. You right, it according to fifteen uh, minutes before Shabbos, you want to put it on. No, the so according to Tosis, it's not Chazara. But it's not tonight. You have to have time in the morning. It, 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 no, you put it down already. You, you don't have a tonight Chazara. Yeah, you, but let's say let's say you took it off a half hour before Shabbos. Right, that's a different story. But an hour before Shabbos, they had a mind to put it back on, and you put it on on the counter. Right. So you keep it make up. Then you can put it back on. But to take it from your refrigerator, if you need tonight Chazara, even if it's Gara Vakatum, we also. Because if your oven is off and it's Gara Vakatum, you want to take the Chal or the potato cooker and put it into the oven, it'll be also if you need tonight Chazara. If you don't need tonight Chazara, as long as it's Gara Vakatum, it's Mutter. We possibly don't need tonight Chazara. So we have a cool on that. We'll see you in a second.
Yeah. If you would need to light Hazar, you couldn't take it out of your refrigerator and put it into the oven, even if the oven's off. What? Even if the oven's off, you need to light Hazar, you don't have to light Hazar. So let's see what it says over here. Yes, I mean, the Choshu is Samach the Chashecha. Oi Samach the Barchu, we'll see what this means in a second. Shehu Kabbalah Shabbos, the Dedon. He was Samach called Kach, Shem Nitzan and Hakadeiro. He after the Atiko, if it's so close, that if it's cold, you can't be Matiachit, be Boyd Yoim. Dinoi can moi be Shabbos Atmoi. It's like Shabbos itself. And therefore it's Osir. Unless it's God of a Kotom. For yes, Makilim is there, for Minig Lahako. It's better to be machmir. Says the Morgan of wrong. So we get to the, the, the remark comes out that someone forgot. That's what someone is having guests. And Taka forgot to put the potato in the oven. So there is a tzad It could be maple. If you have to call it the rov, it's, 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 it's too many small left branches. And you want to put it into the oven. So you could be mako. So I'm, I'm missing something. What's the cool of Avon? The way we learned we, is not going to rush. I mean, either way you have some... No, 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 no not going with any of them. Not going with the Shkumra Bechal. Not going with either of the reasons. Yeah, yeah, nothing. So Before Shabbos, there's no Isser of Chazor. Aha, uh-huh, so the Shkumra is between Tosis and the Rush. It's Tanai Chazor. Right. Exactly, yes, I'm right. Right. But this, the difference of Avon, yes, my kid is there, and the whole thing. For a minute, the Hakal, Rach, Tov, the Hakim, the Mogam, Shane, Tzorik, Hokach. For a case with the Tzorik, if you're having guests, and you forgot to put it in, you're allowed to put it in. But don't do this on a regular basis every area of Shabbos. Take your potato and put it into the oven right before Shabbos when it's in the garden for God. You can't do that. Turn the hachmet. Now, we'll get to the Mogul Mog- Mog- in a second. If you look in the Gro, Dine to my Shabbos Atzmoy. Yeah. So it says like this, Lav Dafka. It doesn't mean it's mamish like Shabbos. Why? Uh, the Osib is a group of a tumor. It's also where it's not garf a cotton. Avo, the group of mutter, it's mutter with kol in him. The ain chilek, the nicha gaber kaka, the oidem yodoi, he don't need to nai chazara, where it's a cost of a rosh. Shom. For Avo gaf to a pedic dalid, like cost of cane, the rosh is mashman and pedic dalid, they need to nai chazara. So the, the, the Gloria is saying basically you don't need Tanai Chazor Erev Shabbos even though the Rosh in Perik Dalit is Mashma you need Tanai Chazor Erev Shabbos over there he's just quoting Rosh and Atoysvis and Atoysvis holds you need Tanai Chazor Erev Shabbos but the Rosh himself doesn't hold that way so basically the Gloria says you don't need Tanai Chazor in Samach and Shabbos and that's what the Mishmuru passes also we pass like the Gloria the air of Shabbos don't need to like Hazar. So that would be a cooler. But that's, that's the summer that you did. We, it comes out the, you pass the cooler. Who comes out? The, 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 the Ramah. No, the Ramah Paskins, they should be Machmir with, with this with this Chumrah Bechal. Right. But even at this Chumrah, there's a Machoikis. You have to have right. Hazar. Right. So that for sure you don't have to have. Right. For sure you don't have to have Tanai Hazar. But when he says the Yishmi, there's a Minik Bechal. You don't know anything. Uh, everything. everything. Yeah, everything is mutter. Everything is mutter. Yeah. Now, there's another kula we're going to have here, a very big kula. That it says over here, if you put it some of the baruchu or some of the mechal shabbos. But I put something in the oven and it doesn't have enough time to heat up. When is that time? When a bench lift? When the lady bench is lift? Or, oh, no, shkir. There's a big difference. Mm-hmm. Right, you put something in the oven, 18 minutes. T- uh, five minutes before lach benching, oh. so it'll get hot by the time Shkir comes around. But when she's, when she, when she's been Kabul Shabbos, it may not be hot yet. It's not going to be hot yet. Right. So the, the, the remark says, right, the Kosher is Samach the Shekha, or is Samach the Baruch. Samach the Baruch means when you're in Kabul Shabbos. Right. So if you look in the in, in the Morgan of Rome, Siv Khan Chavab, some of the Baruch of Gemara said, "Pei Gemara Madlikim, Kosvu, Harashi, Rach, and Mutal Lahadik Pass Betanah." Some of the Baruch of Im Yeshoes Biyoyim. He had to put bread in the oven. Im Yeshoes Biyoyim. She ikum upanei koydim she techshach before it gets dark. Chet Chasav Magamishu said, "Pei Kedz lo Yezvina Shamichata." After Baruch of to the Osam Midai Raisa. The whole thing is not an Isidai Raisa; it's only a Xero. For him, can Kosvu Shesh Lahakav Bedin Zeh. In this halacha. 
to show you could be mekel, and it's not dependent on when you're mekabel Shabbos, it's dependent in shkia. To hagup for eli also el v'shem gzeira, to show us the meir Shabbos also the hagzir be Shabbos. So you see, he looks like the rosh. The whole issue of Erev Shabbos is not Shemir Chata. It's a Gzair Erev Shabbos, Otto Shabbos. But with Shabbos, also Shemir Chata. Im Kein Loma Nigza Samach Labar. So this morning, I've probably seen two things. First of all, you see the reasoning that they're going with is not because of Shemir Chata, like we said on Tysus. The reasoning is because of a Gzair, or maybe I'll do it on Shabbos. And second of all, he says, because of that, we're going to be Makal, and we're going to say that. It's not dependent on your Mechabal Shabbos. As long as the food can get hot by Shkia, then you're okay. So when you bring in Shabbos early, for sure it's not true. Yeah, so it's a Kabbal Shabbos early, in the summer, you never have this issue. Because it's, uh, it's plenty of time till, uh, till Shkia. So we're saying it's not 20 minutes, the 20 minutes that we said we started with... It starts from Shkia, yeah, right. before Shkia, so not from your Mechabal Shabbos. Shabbos. So you're very big cool over here. If you want to put something in the oven, it'll be hot by Shkia, you're okay. If you want to the Magad it'll be okay. There's another big cool over here. It's Shin Kotn Chavzayin, Dirk Kamei B'Shavis. If it's not cooked yet, sorry, the Hagzir, it's Samach Lechashecha. It's Samach Lechashecha. If it's not cooked yet, sorry, the Hagzir, it's Samach Lechashecha. Then you can do it Samach Lechashecha, even if it's in the garden cotton. If it's not cooked, you have nothing to worry about. Why? So the Gazir and the Osul and Merit B'Shavis. But not we don't make a gzeir that you're going to come do it on Shabbos. The vaday lo yevashol b'Shabbos. It definitely won't be mevashol b'Shabbos. This is only according to the Rosh. That says the issue erev Shabbos is a gzeir, but to Shabbos. If you hold the issue is shem yichate, then you have an issue here also. <coughs> you see the Magen Avram is going the whole time. The reason for this issue samach for Shabbos is a gzeir, but to Shabbos, not because of. So this itself has its own Shem Yechat. Avo smag, ve smag for God's Mordechai, osu af bezeh, avo chay le gamri shari samach le chashay chamamish. But everyone agrees. Toiv le hachma says the Morgan Avram, ve ain little like the day of meyakira, ve little like gabay tanish, ve ain a girl of a kata samach le chashay chamamish. Therefore you can't go ahead and take something from the kira and put it on a tanish, ve ain a girl of a kata. Because that is chazara. Samach le Shabbos, you have to have garav v'kotim. So never put something on any garav v'kotim. Samach le Shabbos. I feel a samach le Shabbos. So he must be holding there when he says any move of shellus in the one before as well. It has to be garav v'kotim. Yeah, has to be garav v'kotim. Has to be garav v'kotim. Come that it would be a bigger problem to put something on that is that is not mivushal called sarkai before Shabbos. Then then putting it on if it's already mivushal the Bush called Sarkai, no, if it's Bush called Sarkai, it's, it's, it's worse than any of the called Sarkai, right? According to this rush. Yeah. Yeah. But we found that already quite shi here. But isn't it? Oh, chai. Chai, not any of the So, the Bush of any of the If we're saying over here in this in, in this Magan Avram Chavzayin, any of the aren't you coming on to Shihir Be Yisur? According, because there you, you you've got to worry about. She wants her to do it, right? Yeah. Isn't that weird? He's right. He's right. Only according to Chananya. According to the Bonner, with any of the Bushos called Sarkai, you can't leave it on the fire if it's not Garvah Gotham. Right. Shihir. Oh, Shahir. Oh, Shahir is a problem. We're going now, we're going now in, in this, okay, only be according to Hananya. Uh-huh. According to, according to the Bona, anyway, it's us. That's what Michelle's called Tarka, according to the Bona. To Shahir also. The stomach for Rally. The stomach for Rally, yeah. You have to go on with Hananya, he's right. Okay. Only go on with Hananya. We have to uh-huh. keep on weighing in on Shahir, Hazara. Let's, let's just finish up the seat over here. The Dafka Gabbard Kira Mamish. Is a problem. Our list moich, which we had before, smicha. I feel a samach for eish. The markim she has not very sorry. I feel a samach for kashayich. This whole chumra is not by smicha. It's only a gaber kira mamish. But with taner and chilik, by the hags of olav, by list moich etzloi, by taner there's no difference. The dafka the markim she has to let this boy. I will any has to let this boy show I'm sorry. I feel the b'shabes. It's not yet to let this boy. We're putting it down. It's mutter. Because there is no Isra B'chalav, it has to be a Mokka in the Tziyat Shalad this boy. Says the Mokka of Ram Chavtet, I fill some of the Chashecha. I fill the Nistan and the Gamri. Even though it's Nistan and the Gamri, it's Mutin. The Imlech and I fill the Shabbat, sorry. Meaning, 
If it's Samach, it's Mutter to put it in even on Shabbos, which we had from Achlokus, the and the and the Chivega before. We're not going to get back into that now. But uh, Samach is definitely Mutter if it's not Agabit Kira Mamish. Fine. Sure. Yeah.